top of the morning, friends and family. <laughs> We're back in the snake room. We've got my long lost sister visiting us from Belgium. Hello. You guys have met her before. Hello. Actually, I'll put a link right up here. Yeah. Last time she was here, she was. Can we tell people you're pregnant? Yeah, we can tell people. We're telling we're people. <laughs> <laughs> tell all the people we're pregnant. <laughs> Last time she was here and on video, actually, we did a video with her being pregnant and talking about that and snakes. So different pregnancy. Different pregnancy. It was the same. Yeah, this is not the same pregnancy. <laughs> there. Here's the last one. This is my. Maya, can you this is my niece Maya. Hello. Hello. <laughs> and she's gonna be hanging out with some snakes for her first time uh-huh and that should be pretty sweet you guys didn't know this but when we were thinking about the possibility of having a girl we were thinking we would name her naya oh yeah you yeah. had me after after yeah. the fact mm -hmm. and then it was always like and they were like when we were like oh we we should maybe not name our daughter maya if we happen to have one now but we we, we named her leia moon and this is maya lou it was oh, like they're yeah. destined to have similar son <laughs> names maya lou and leia moon <laughs> We think, Maya, you want to you want to take out some snakeies? <gasps> you want to see the slime? You want to see the snake, Maya? She's like, I see it. It's right there. Yeah. We talking about mom? There's the snake. I see it. It's yeah. Right there. That's what do you Halo. think, Maya? Uh, what do you think? Bar soap. soap. She says, look out, Leia. Look out, Leia. She says, bar soap. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My buddy Joel from State 40 Exotics has been doing a, uh, exp inspiring people to show their top favorite three snakes in their group. So I think I was going to include that in this video as well. Pull out my three favorite I'm snakes. Okay with that. Yeah? As but long as it's not that one. That's, uh, unfortunately, <laughs> that, unfortunately, that's not my snake. The only one without a name tag. <laughs> we'll go with no, yeah, without no name. Her name, her name is Grumpy. But oh, I mean, it is? I, I named her Grumpy. Oh, yeah. okay. It's still Garrett's snake, yeah. Garrett. Ooh, I know what snake we should pull out from Maya right now. Here, you want to take this thing? Um, I don't know. Say what's up. <laughs> okay, what's up? Okay, we're gonna look at somebody else. Ha <laughs> ha! There's Maya Lou. Can you say hello? Hello. Hello. Zach, Ethan. Eli named this snake yesterday. He named it Carrot, and that's how we're spelling it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, you like that? You want to hold it? Yeah. yeah. You looking for the head? Yeah. There's the yeah, head. Of slang. The head of the slang. What do you think? You wanna... Baby. Yeah, the baby. Yeah. Babies are also interesting, huh? <laughs> for those of you who are maybe hearing what she's saying, she's saying slang, which is snake in Flemish, which is what we speak at home in Belgium. So if you don't understand some of the words she says, it's because she's not yet two years old. And also because she's uh, learning, she speaks Flemish and English. So kind of a mix going on here. We have some uh, Belgian viewers as well. Uh, they've commented oh, okay. below, like when Eli's wearing his uh, his Belgium soccer jersey, that we'll get some comments, but like, yeah, it's Belgium! <laughs> Do you know if they're from the northern part or the southern part if of Belgium? If you are watching and you're from the northern or southern part of Belgium, can you comment down below and let us know? Because then, I don't know how you say snake in French. Oh, I don't but know how you say snake. It might be French-speaking Belgians, you never know. Right, I don't know how you say snake in French either. Yeah. What do you think, Maya? Are you rearranging Uncle Brian's? Snake organization skills here. What do you think, Missy? You want to hold the snakey? Or you just want me to hold? You want to hold it? Look, put out your two hands like this. Two hands. Here. I'm gonna face you towards Serpent. towards Grandma with the camera too. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Sit on your butt. Hold out your hands. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You okay, hold, them yeah. like hold them out flat like this. Hold them out flat like that. And the other hand like this. Ah. Ah. Oh, nice. Wow. So moy. Good job, Maya. Moy. What do you think, Boo? What do you think? Nice? Feeling pretty good? Yeah. <laughs> okay, you guys, I guess I have the snake in my hands now. So, <laughs> everybody just hang out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, zapches, huh? Zapches. I'm not, I'm, this is a moment for me to shoot some uh, slow mo b roll.
shout out to mom, running camera number two over there, and Uncle Mati. Well, not my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna, sh we're gonna sh we're gonna sh we're gonna bring out Halo, my number one top favorite snake. Joel. How is this supposed to go? Uh, with the other snake. Halo is a little bit in shed right now, unfortunately. I'm hoping that she will get out of shed by the time the promoter show actually happens, which is happening now in reality as you're watching this, but hopefully she's coming with me to Pomona. She might shut out in time. If she doesn't, she's not coming. What do you think, Maya? Look at the big snakey. That's a big snake right there, huh? What do you think? Atun? She wants to take it out. <laughs> Atun? Hmm? You gonna take it out? You wanna pet her? You wanna put her across your lap? Okay. She's a really, really nice snakey. Oh, big one, huh? <laughs> And of course the golden rule showing off your favorite snake when it's in shed. No, never never a better time to show off your favorite snake than when it's in shed. Yeah, she's coming. You gonna pet her, my No, I did not. Halo's over it. Mm -hmm. She <laughs> she's in shed. I didn't really want to bother her too much anyway, but she's She's made the, the personal decision to leave the party. Write us. Send us postcards. So my second favorite snake might be locked up with another snake right now, so we might not pull her out. Oh yeah, they're definitely locked back there. Yeah, so my second favorite snake, the queen, clown pied, ball python. She's having sexy time right now with her boyfriend, so we're gonna... We're gonna leave him alone. You wanna say something to the people, Maya? Paper. No kula? No slum? Another snake? You wanna bring another snake? So my third favorite snake is actually a scrub python. <laughs> Might be, it's a little more advanced than for you, Missy. Yeah, I maybe think, next to year. Hold. <laughs> but maybe no she's actually a really nice scrub python. <laughs> she's like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Isn't it nap time now? <laughs> you ready to chill out? And of course, she's going into shed too. The top one and three favorite snakes are both going to the shed. The second snake is busy making new favorite snakes. Matthias, you want to hold my third favorite snake? Snake? Sure. Just went for it. Just went for it like a champion. Yeah, this is this is Annie. You can actually take the whole stick with her. No pencil. Oh yeah, this one feels different than the other ones, huh? Oh, yeah. So my favorite thing about this snake, not only is that it is a scrub python, which is really cool in itself, but she's very, very mellow. I mean, she wasn't to start with, but after working with her, she's going to become, you know, a very chill snake. Obviously, I, I trust her to hang out with other people that don't handle her often, and, and she's just very good. It's a nice thing to see the, the species that are less far removed from the wild starting to become a little more docile and handleable by the average, uh, average person. On average. Yeah, so her, her stick is kind of it's like her uh, binky. Yeah. <laughs> it's her comfort her comfort stick. Upstairs and see what those boys know. Also, I wanted to give a big shout out to Tabasco, even though Cholula is my favorite. It's just a shirt. By the way, I'm on day four right now of no sugar, and I'm a little bit sick from the uh, withdrawals, but feeling pretty good. Energy is definitely high. See if we can keep it going. Whoa! It's our party. Hey Noah. What do you know? I know. Dinosaurs? Yeah. What about dinosaurs? That they get so big because 
carnivores eat meat, which is super duper healthy for them, and herbivores no! eat plants, which is super duper healthy for them, and omnivores eat fish and meat and plants, so I they know. grow huge, but not bigger than dinosaurs because they're pterosaurs, but, but, the pescatarians like Spinosaurus and Baryonyx, they are the ones that grow huge. Bigger than the carnivores, but not bigger than the herbivores. What pet eaters? That's all I know. Hey Eli, what do you know? I know. Spines, and they have also legs and claws and teeth and teal and feet and also eyes. And that's what I know. All right, guys. Well, I think we're gonna take off out of here, true to toddler fashion. I think I think Maya's ready to close up shop, and we're ready to close up shop. And can you say? Zorg voor jezelf en zorg voor elkaar. I need sugar!